Heart to Heart, a Catholic media ministry in association with the Bellarmine Jesuit Retreat House, presents Seeds of Joy, stories for Easter and throughout the year. Today's story seed is The Sense of a Goose. From Paul's first letter to the Thessalonians, chapter 5, verse 11. Therefore, comfort and upbuild one another, as indeed you are doing. We've all heard the expression, silly goose. But did you ever realize that we humans can learn more than a few things from these so-called bird brains? Dr. Robert McNeish of Baltimore worked for many years as a science teacher and studied the behavior of these migratory birds. In 1972, he wrote Lessons from the Geese and delivered it as a sermon for his church. Since then, his observations have been cited in numerous organizational and leadership training programs. Five lessons. Number one, when in the V formation, each goose flaps its wings, creating an uplift for the goose immediately following. This gives the whole flock more flying range than if each bird were on its own. Lesson, those who share a common direction and sense of community can get where they are going more quickly and easily because they travel on the thrust of one another's effort. Number two, whenever a geese falls out of formation, it greatly affects its flight, impacting the drag of the air as well as air resistance from trying to go it alone. The goose immediately gets back into formation to take advantage of the lifting power of the bird immediately in front of them. Lesson, if we have as much sense as a goose, we will stay in formation with those who are headed the same way we are. Number three, when the lead goose gets tired, it rotates back into the V, allowing others to take the lead for a while. Lesson, sometimes we need to admit we need a rest and to allow others to lead, and help us. Number four, the geese honk from behind to encourage those up front to keep up their speed. Lesson, we all need encouragement, so make sure what we are putting out there to others is encouraging and not hurtful. And finally, number five, when a goose gets sick or hurt and falls out of formation, Two geese go with it and provide help and protection. They stay with the herding goose until it is able to fly. Then they set out together to catch up with the flock. Lesson? No one needs to do life alone. If we have the sense of a goose, we will stand by one another and bear each other's burdens. It seems like it's becoming easier and easier to live a life apart from others, with little or no social interaction. But God did not create us to be alone. He created us to be together, in community, to help each other. Do not have the sense of a goose in knowing that we need each other would be downright foul. Watering the Seeds. Which one of the lessons resonated with you the most? Why so? When did you or didn't you live this life lesson? And what happened?